Maria, and I'm here today to share a project with you for I Am Roses. I have this really, really, really fun tropical um, wooden frame that I've altered actually for my mom. They just got back from a trip from to Maui a couple of weeks ago, and I really liked this picture of my mom looking out at the ocean. I thought the colors were absolutely beautiful, and I thought it would go well with the um, Graphic 45 Tropical Travelogue collection. Really, really pretty um, prints and colors that are very tropical-y. So um, I will have links to all of the products that I used for I Am Roses listed on my blog and my blog will be in the description box below. So let me tell you how I started out. This was just a plain wood frame. So the first thing that I did was I sprayed it with, um, I didn't spray it, I painted it with a coat of gesso and after that had dried I painted it, I painted it with a coat of Calypso Blue acrylic paint. Um, several coats of that and then I sprayed it down with my Lindy Stamp Gang Buccaneer Bay Blue Moon Shadow Mist and then a coat of Desert Moon Cactus Gold Glitz Spritz by Lindy Stamp Gang and it has a gorgeous shimmer. I love the way that the texture, or not the texture, but the the frame turned out. Really, really pretty. And then I took um, some lace that I had in my stash, some brown lace at the bottom here, and then um, some of this ruffle trim, ruffle pleated satin trim from Carla S001 and then um, a row of black beads from Carla's Etsy as well. And then I actually created this cluster of flowers um, using a bunch of different I Am Roses products. So in the back here are some of these really, really awesome. These are really, really big natural skeleton leaves. They actually measure about six inches in height from tip to tip. So really, really cute. Those are great for um, projects like this where they just kind of fill in the background there. And then these sprays I actually got at Hobby Lobby, the black sprays. And then these leaves right here, there are longer leaves from I Am Roses, and I just um, sprayed those. You, as you can see, they're like a lighter two-tone green, and I just sprayed those with my um, Lindy Stamp Gang Gator Gumbo Olive and tucked those behind there. And then for these two flowers here, they actually started out as the puffy white daisies that I Am Roses carries. And this one right here had been sprayed with my Lindy Stamp Gang Grab a Guy Gold Starburst Spray. And then the one in front here was sprayed with um, Cajun Carnelian Red Lindy Stamp Gang Starburst Spray. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. I love those um, puffy white daisies and how versatile, versatile they are. And then in the center of them I used some of the stamens from I Am Roses as well, and I actually altered those up with my Lindy Stamp King sprays as well. This one was sprayed with the um, Red Hot Poker Orange Starburst Spray by Lindy Stamp Gang, and then the one inside the yellow flower was sprayed with the Cajun Carnelian Red by Lindy Stamp Gang. And then this flower right here, the blue flower, was actually these flat um, flat flowers and I just folded them up and then hot glued in the center P25-157 and again I'll have links to all of the products that I used listed on my blog so don't, be, don't worry about writing those down um, but that one had been sprayed with Tainted Love Teal Lindy Stamp Gang Spray and then the center of that I used the same stamen from I Am Roses and sprayed it with um, the Grab a Guy Gold by Lindy Stamp Gang so I love the way that those colors matched um, this paper collection so well. And I love the dimension and how full these um, flowers are from I Am Roses. They're so much fun to, to create. And then over here, this was just a piece from the paper collection that I um, cut out and then distressed with my edge distresser and inked up with my Tim Holtz um, Walnut Stain Distress Ink. And then I just cut, fussy cut out two things from the paper collection here. And then I'm um, a sticker from the collection Island Adventure. And then these stickers actually came with the collection as well. They have um, a set of alphabet stickers. And so I put Maui there. And then this is just some recollections bling at the top. And then this is one of the R40 roses by I Am Roses. And I sprayed that with the Red Hot Poker Orange by Lindy Stamp Gang. And then two more of those leaves that I showed you earlier. I just sprayed them with Gator Gumbo Olive. So a really tropical-y frame, um, super fun to create using a bunch of different I Am Roses products. I will have links again to all the products that I used listed on my blog, and my blog will be in the description box below. Thanks for watching. Bye!